What's up, YouTube? It's Adam from I'm a Music Mogul. Welcome to Tips and Tricks Thursday, episode number 27. Today I'm going to show you how to apply multiple fades across multiple tracks or regions. I've been getting a lot of questions on how to add multiple fades to multiple tracks. Well, I'm going to show you right now. Um, you basically, you really can't use the, there's no way to use the uh, crossfade tool in Logic, but there is another way in which I'm going to show you right now. So let's get straight into the tutorial. All right, so the first step is basically selecting the tracks that you want to fade in, fade out, crossfade, whatever you want to do. You got to select the tracks that you want to uh, affect as a whole. So what I'm going to do is just going to hit Apple A to select all my tracks over here because I only have three. And after I select them all, I'm going to make sure my inspector window is open. And I'm going to scroll down to where it says fade in. And in this darker gray area, click and drag up. And that will draw in a fade across all your three tracks or as many tracks as you had selected. It will draw in a fade for you. Now, if you already know the numbers in which you want to go at and you're already used to doing this process, you just double click the number and type in a fade and it will change the length of that fade for you very easily by just typing it in. And if you want to change the length of the, uh, sorry, the, um, the type of the curve, you can just click in this gray, gray area here. Click drag up for that kind of style curve. Let me zoom in. Or if you want the other style curve, a faster fade in right there for you. There it is right there. So you can either drag up or drag down for the curves. Very simple, very easily. Let's go ahead and add a fade out to these tracks as well. So again, hit Apple A to make sure all my tracks are selected. Go to the fade out section, click and drag up. There's my fade out and I want to change the style of the curve. So I'm going to go ahead and put in a faster fade out. And there it is right there. That is how you add multiple fades to multiple tracks in Logic. So if you have any other questions, you can ask me in the comment section and I will try and get back to you. For more good videos, remember to rate and subscribe. And uh, until then, I will talk to you soon, guys. All right, later.